In this video, I'm gonna show you how to turn a video like this into a square video that looks like this in Premiere Pro. What's going on, Thomas Jordan here, and on this channel I help you grow your network and your net worth with video podcasting. Now, the three main uses for square videos are creating clips from your podcast and turning them in, turning them in to micro content, square videos for Facebook, Facebook ads, and Instagram posts. Now, this is all part of pillar number two of my paid program, which is called the Video Flix Effect, where I show you step-by-step -step how to edit videos just like this one. Now, let's jump right into Premiere and I'll show you how it's done. All right, now that we're in Premiere Pro, what we're gonna do is go to File, New Sequence, and you'll go to Digital SLR, depending if it was shot in 24 frames per second or 30, mine was shot in 24 and we're just gonna go into settings, and this is gonna say 1920 by 1080, and that gives you a 16 by nine ratio, but watch this, 1080 by 1080, that's gonna switch it to one by one, and that is gonna give you that perfect square for Facebook, Facebook ads, uh, Instagram, things like that. Now you can save it as a preset, but I've already got it saved, so I'm just gonna do Facebook, square you can already see now it's changed right and all we're going to do now is find the footage that you want to use and for me that's this one right here it's going to bring this little pop-up keep exi keep existing settings and all you're going to do is normally nine times out of ten if it's shot like this you can rescale it i'm going to say it's about 60 but you can just bring it down so that's about eh, about 56 yeah let's just go with 57 to be safe so you say normally it's 60. Yep, there you go. Now what you can do is you can uh, keep these black bars just like this and you can add text in them like this. So this is video intro, right? And you can do that for here. You can do that down here. I know that that's not pretty, but this is just an example of what you can do. Let's get that out of there, yeah, whatever. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is uh, if you want to put color behind these bars, you're just gonna go to new color mat. Yeah, let's just go to the blue. I like that blue here, that's close enough. And now what all you're gonna do is since it's on a different layer, you're gonna put this on a different layer bring that layer here and stretch it all the way across and you can use any of your brand colors so now there you go and it looks like that let's trim it up just to make it look halfway decent so you get the picture all right let's clear that up <laughs> And see, now there you go. So, what's going on? Thomas Jordan here. And see, perfect square. You're done. It really isn't that hard. It's super easy. And once again, you can add text up here. And if you want to leave it this blank, uh, you could actually add your captions, but that's kind of an extra step. And all we're going to do now is uh, like uh, this clip is done. So, all you need to do is render it out. <laughs> You got the green bars here. You go to File, Export, Medium. You can do H64, high bit rate. I like to do YouTube. Uh, if you wanna make sure, this is the most important part. Make sure you click Match Source. And then render at maximum quality, use render. And you're done. It's that easy. And now it's time to take action. What I want you to do is download my free YouTube Quick Start Guide. It's a free video mini course that shows you how to create professional videos for YouTube without the tech overwhelm. The link for that is in the description below. And now that you know how to make a square video in Premiere Pro, check out this video right here where I show you how to convert videos like this into vertical video. That way you can use it for your Instagram Reels, Instagram Stories, TikTok, and of course, YouTube Shorts. 
We'll see you next time.